Hello, uh, my name is Roy Clark. I'm a senior here at uh, UMBC. I transferred from AACC. Uh, I work at a software engineering firm in Bolton, Maryland uh, for the Navy. Um, and I, um, <coughs> I was asked to speak for very briefly about the things that I liked most about uh, the community college and the things that I loved most about uh, UMBC. And it's really a duality of purpose. Um, the community college is a much more personable, uh, involved system where the class size is smaller and it was very much more important uh, for me personally because it got me more interested and more motivated for my work. Uh, I'm a computer science major, I guess I should imagine that. Um, and so many of the professors I had at uh, AACC were critical in getting me involved and interested in that field and really showing me what was available uh, in terms of careers and goals in that field. And so that was the best thing I took from AACC. And then I came here and it's like, the entire world is open to you because there are so many more diverse opportunities and uh, fields available here that just broaden your horizon. So you, you deal with research and with engineering and with development of new and exciting technologies and all of that goes into just increasing the motivation and building upon the work that I did at AACC. And so that was really what built well, well between the community college and the four-year university here. Um, and so why do I like STEM? Uh, well, it's a very exciting field. Um, every time something new comes up on the news and I see something interesting, and you know, we landed on Mars earlier this year, that was really good. Um, <laughs> and so, all of these different things come in to build our world. It's really how you perceive the world that is based on your education and, and technology and uh, perception and communication. And all of those things are helped, built, and designed by uh, STEM fields. And so I really feel like with STEM, you're generating the next step every time. Uh, and so that's what I would like to do. Roar has kept the 4.0 at both places. Give him a hand. <laughs> but but you were talk, we were talking about the fact that you um, that it was it's not smooth sailing just in terms of courses you had to take or retake and prerequisites and those. Talk about that a minute. Because my point is we don't want to just hit the good and the good. We need to understand the challenges. There are always challenges. We should always know that. And if we're secure, we can talk about it. So talk about the challenge you have with the data structures course or something like that. Right. right. Uh, so I graduated from Andrew Community College with a computer science transfer degree that uh, is designed to give you the resources necessary to come to the four-year university and start uh, at, in your computer science field. Um, and many of the credits that I had at AACC were originally from uh, AP courses that I had in high school. Um, and those credits didn't transfer exactly here. Um, and so in order to fulfill many of the requirements that I needed to be at the appropriate level at the, at the four year university here, um, I had to use some of the courses that weren't exactly correct at, the AAC, a, at AACC to fulfill requirements here. Um, so for example, the data structures course, um, it's a computer science course uh, at AACC, should transfer to the computer science course, uh, data structures course here, but it didn't because I had to use it for a previous requirement uh, at this location. Um, and so I had to retake it, um, which was good because it reinforced the knowledge, but. You need positive. <laughs> <laughs> you, need positive. <laughs> you get my point that we need to keep looking. We need to be looking at the issues to see how we can learn from each person's situation to improve. That's the point. Most important, no, he's an A student wherever he goes. Give him one more hand. Thank you.